Bro, forget that heat, bitch. Nani. In a state of my life, you know how to man, and I'm bad in every sense. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is mostly for the ladies. Okay, I'm going to be showing you guys how um I prepare my hair for when I want to get wigs put on. I'm like, it's a wig life I'm living for a month or two months, you know. So I'm not just going to wash my hair, you know, put oil, do all back, wear wig for the two years. After two years, you lose your hair and wash it and do oil and do all back back. <laughs> you know, I'm not doing that today. I'm going to show you guys how I should prepare my natural hair, especially if you have, if you're a natural 4C hair girl like I am. Okay, for starters, you pre pull your hair. So I've been preparing my hair for two days. It's wrong, actually. You should prepare your hair for your highest 40 minutes, depending how you want to do it i would have washed my hair yesterday but we had things we were doing so i couldn't so now i'm washing my hair today that's that's what's up so i'm going to show you guys how i do it i don't i don't know if i can carry my camera to my phone to the bathroom and wash my hair you know i'll show you guys but i'll just give you guys like the rundown so the first thing i did was pre-pull my hair i did a mixture of my coconut olive castor and almond oil that was like to pull my hair every section then i sectioned it and I sectioned it. If you had watched my um POP video, you know that I had like a slick bun, so there's a lot of gel on my hair, so I have to wash it clean. Okay, and I'm going to be washing using my black soap shampoo I made myself. You guys can check out, I'll leave the link, the card up here. You guys can tap on it and see. You guys can make your own DIY black soap shampoo by Sparabin and Sulfate Free. Okay, so without talking too much, I'll go and prepare to wash my hair, then I'll come yeah, back no. and tell you the next step. So guys, I'm in the bathroom now. Um, I figured a way to do it. I'm going to be leaving my tripod, my phone, everything is outside by the door. This door area, like here. <laughs> okay, if you look to the side, that's where my things are. And then I have a shirt, because you don't usually you're not supposed to use towel on your hair, because that would like talk on your hair and make it break something like that shot ready now my nigga was good guys i just want to point out that when you're washing your hair you should always focus on your scalp especially when you're doing a shampoo like just on the scalp like right there I wish I had the hair massager thing to like really brush my hair. So I'm done. Oh, look at that. That's so I'm done like shampooing. I just want to drain the water out so I'll show you guys how it looks. Um, now I'm going to condition my hair. The conditioner I usually use is finished. Sorry, there's water dripping everywhere on my body. This is how these YouTubers do it. I need a swimming trunk with her. Eh. Anyway, I use I usually use this conditioner. It's a moisturizer conditioner. I use it for my hair. Um, I use the VO5 strawberries and cream. It smells like the scent is so beautiful. I, I love this conditioner because it, it has a long lasting scent on my hair. My hair smells like strawberries and cream all the time. But look at this, guys. Ugh, the light. There we go. Look at that. I have some more remains. I'm so upset. I don't know. Can't I open this thing? Like, anyway, because I'm out of that, I found. I'm coming to see something is coming out. Something is coming out. <laughs> I found this in my mom's bathroom. It's this. I think every Nigerian person would know this um, conditioner. I don't know. It's light to bright. Check it here. Okay, it's the anti dandruff conditioner, it prevents dandruff, pre prevents broken and ends, puts in, makes hair radiant, shiny and manageable. I'm just looking at the ingredients, I'm like. Anyway, I'm going to use this. Hopefully, my hair doesn't burn. I don't have dandruff, so I'm just going to use this because I do not have a conditioner on the ground. 
so for con so for conditioning unlike shampoo i usually let it stay on my strand so like so oh 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 my god it smells like damatol do you know damatol <coughs> what jesus my only consolation is my scalp be minty <laughs> so right now i've put the rice water in my hair i've rinsed off the conditioner the rice water right now is in my hair i mix it with a little bit of water so that's why it's just gonna like this like if you guys are thinking of doing rice water you should usually put some um, lemon peel or orange peels inside so if you don't like if you can't stand the smell because it smells terribly but right now the rest of the is there now i'm going to start my conditioning my deep conditioner but the conditioner works like so well like i, I can feel my curls like just forming makes me very happy <laughs> like my conditioner like i wasn't prepared today at all i was not prepared and i went out yesterday like i was at the mall like i was in my natural hair section like this and i walked past anyway my deep conditioner just remains like that look and i probably this can only cover like one section of my hair basically so we are going to mix it together so i'm going to mix this conditioner back i actually like it i like the way it makes me i like the way it's minty like do you know the way when you take mints is where your insides feel it just feels clear like you can breathe well i feel my hair can breathe well anyway i'm going to mix this into this right now i'm making my own like quick deep conditioner plus i i really wanted to do an avocado but i couldn't get one so I pull, I'm pulling that in, I pull like, that should be okay. Then I'm going to add in my Goya Extra Virgin Olive Oil. Wait, did I block it? Okay. So I'm going to pull that in. That will just make it all the more a good condition treatment. So this is a very realistic wash day for me because most times I'm not prepared. I just see in my heart, I'm going to wash my hair and I don't check what my, my product has to remain. So, you can do your own, like, just get a normal conditioner and put oils in it, and it's automatically a deep conditioner. Cruising in the city, I'm sipping on jeans. I'm, a, I'm tipsy. Two bad bitches on me. me. They freaky. I don't need to spend my dough. She gon' get this deep for sure. Turn up to the party, your eyes on me, my G, I be big shot, oh Pull up in a Benzema, she a broke bitch, I don't wear free that Lifestyle, my shoes, my trip, made a girl that trip Bad man like this, don't touch my shit Come tunnels, I be killing these hoes Rocks on my piece like infinity stones Can't cross me, double up, who the boss be? Fuck the loss, it's new shit, Bill Cosby She I'm getting money now She said get out the friend zone, meet me in the end zone Get out the friend zone, get out the friend zone, meet me in the end zone. Cause she see I'm getting money now. She said, get out the friend zone, 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 meet me in the end zone. I'm still trapping the bando, police out front door, scarting up bro. I said I was going to show you guys how much hair in my old head. This is it. Can you guys see it? So, guys, I just finished. This is after like three hours i'm not going to lie i was i didn't watch merry men i was watching anime and i was I lost anyway i just rinsed out my hair and this is the review Ooh, can you guys see that my hair feels so soft and like looks so good <laughs> But just to show you, like, I still have that minty feeling after you use something mint on my hair from the conditioner. But I'm going to move on to moisturizing. So for my moisturizing, I've, I've, I've sectioned my hair up. Uh, I'm going to start with this back section because, like I said, this is the softest part of my hair. I'll divide that into two. I work on this. I moisturize using the LCO method. So. 
L means my ugh, the lights has killed me. My living ah Garfield. L means my living conditioner. Then C, I mean O is my oil. This is the oil mixture. This is almond, coconut, castor, and olive oil. Then for cream, sorry, my my hair jewel is that section. For cream, I'm using this shea butter. So we're going to begin. So now as I'm done moisturizing, um, the LOC, my leave-in, the oil, and the cream, that's my shea butter. My hair is so sleepy. Okay, so the next step is I'm going to blow dry my hair. Just for extra security, I'm going to detangle again. Just to tangle that. Okay, oh, and this is all cleaned up. This is argan oil heat defense leave-in spray. So I'm going to spray this before I put on my blow dryer so that I don't have his damage what is wrong with you Garfield the money now she said get out the friend zone meet me in the end zone get out the friend zone get out the friend zone meet me in the end zone so I'm done with this side and we'll do a quick lens check this is it stops at the top of my boobs So I'm going to blow dry every single section, every single straw head. So I'm done with the blow drying. Obviously, it's not for like maximum stretch. It's just to stretch my hair out a bit. I could just go out like this. I'm like, hello, I'm here. <laughs> anyway, so I'm going to, my sister is going to help me braid the hair all back. Okay, well, I want to show you guys. This is the brush I used to detangle, and as you can see, where's the hair? There's like there's little like the shed hair for me combing again. This is this is all the hair. This is all the hair. There's, there's absolutely nothing. Makes me very happy. Get out the friend zone, meet me in the end zone. Say she not my type. Who told you nine got a type? Nine just love her loose thing. I don't fuck with groupies. She down for nine years and I play. Let me put you on some new thing. No be on some booting. I ain't tryna cut this baiting. Pull up in a BMW. Sex in the back door. That girl we done. Baby girl, you know. So guys, she's done with the hair. Seven. It's really well I was in, I can't remember last time I even did all back. Anyway, to finish it off, I'm going to apply my black castor oil around my edges. So now that I'm done applying on my edges, I'll just you know apply the rest like in every line like that. And that is that is all then you know when it's time for the wig you just pack this back and wear your wig and that's it. So like maybe Next week or next two weeks, I will then lose it, then wash it again. But before that, I'll be spraying my hair with oil and water just so that it won't dry out as much because we tend to neglect our hair once it's all back like this. So that's not the plan. I'll mix the oil and the water, then spritz it, spray it in my hair every day. If I remember, tie my satin scarf, wear my bonnet. I have a pillow I wrapped with satin material. My makeshift satin pillow. That is all for today's video. If you guys enjoyed it, please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next week. Bye.